Peeps, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and today is my birthday. So I thought I would bring you along on some birthday shenanigans. Uh, first up, I went and got a haircut. Oh, it was desperate. I'm just going to say, but we did cut it into a style that I could let grow out if I wanted to, because I'm kind of thinking I want to, but what I had before it was driving me crazy. I thought about getting the scissors out. We're not going to do that. I got myself a birthday Duncan because why not? But I'm getting ready. I'm going to have lunch with my family and I wanted to share with you. Now this, these products were sent to me, but I did pick what I wanted and I do stand behind them because I am in love. Uh, the company is Dossier and they sell perfume. And these are, um, I'm gonna read how it works. Uh, your Dossier order, oh no. Our mission is to deliver the highest quality, luxury-inspired fragrances at a fair price, giving you the freedom to explore new scents. Thank you for giving us a try. Now, I can't tell you what, because I don't remember what scents these were supposed to mimic, but this one is Aromatic Star Anise, and it is so, so light. I love it. It's so light and fragrant, I cannot wait for springtime. Oh, it's a magnetic lid. Did not know that. Um, love it, it's light and airy. And then I got sent to me amber, Ambery Saffron. I believe this is an opium type scent. And I'm actually wearing this today. It is, this one is definitely a darker, like more musky scent and it's saffron orange blossom, jasmine, plum, cedarwood, I think is what gives it that feel. And then um, oak, moss, fir, and amber are the middle, top, middle, and base notes. Now, what I love about these, and thank you for bearing with me, is that they stay on. So I bought other perfumes, non-name brand, and I don't have an issue with that whatsoever. I love perfume. But when the scent is gone within 20 minutes, it's not worth even the reduced amount. This stays with me, which is what I like. I like to be able to put perfume on in the morning and get to the afternoon and still feel like I can smell that lightness of it. So these are the two that I got. The company is Dossier and there is going to be a link in the bio below if you wanna try them out. It is, um, they, they do guarantee their product. So if you get one and you don't like it, then they will, um, you can send it back and exchange it for a different scent. And I think they have other products as well. So it is risk-free purchasing to try them out. And they come in this lovely package, which would make great for gifting. But today I'm gonna be Ambery Saffron for my birthday lunch. So I will bring you along with me. Also in the scent department, I was at Target and I got Iowa Pine. Mrs. Myers, I love this cleaning product, not sponsored, although if they want to sponsor me, I'm on board with it. Um, just cleaner. I love it. Christmassy smell. All right, I got to get ready. I got to put some more zhuzh in my hair and get ready to go. I'll see you later. Well, I failed at vlogging on my birthday. <laughs> I just wanted to spend time with my family and enjoy the day. It's Sunday. I just went and met a lovely subscriber. Thank you again so much. That was amazing. And I appreciate you finding those snowmen for me. Then I just ran over to Trader Joe's because like you do, you got to go to Trader Joe's. So I'll show you what I got. I didn't need much, but I got some of these sharp cheddar cheese. I like to have cheese in the fridge just for snacking and grab on the go. And I'm being lazy this week, so I grabbed some already made hard boiled eggs. Ooh, pub cheese. I love this stuff. And I got the cheddar with horseradish. It's really good on my keto crackers. So I grabbed some pub cheese. I'm just such a snacker. I don't do a lot of mealing, I guess. Um, I did get some Black Forest ham with water added, 98% fat free. And it's just perfect amount for me for a couple days of lunches. And I have, you know, cheese that I can wrap it in. And then the last thing I picked up is some grilled artichoke halves in the jar. And I think this is water or, yeah, juice. Um, so, 
That's really all I got at Trader Joe's. I went in looking for that instant iced coffee and then realized quickly that it's a seasonal item, so I'm out, but that's okay. It'll be okay. Now I'm headed to my house. I am working on sewing, so I'll talk to you when I get there about what I'm sewing for Christmas gifts. I'm making bags for some of my people. And then I'm going to fill them with goodies. So I'm going to go see actually if World Market is open. But if not, it's okay. All right, let's go home. Okay, guys, I finished. I did some stash busting for Christmas gifts. So I did sew these bags. And this is a pretty decent sized one. Each of them most, well, this one has a home already. So I made that one. And this one here. I love it's a lake life pattern I got this a few years ago all this fabric came from Joanne unless I say Dollar Tree this I'm obsessed with I love having project bags that match you know the season of the project that's in it so for my Christmas stitching or knitting or whatever and this is a fall bag which I love the simplicity of it so I made those and then I made a cheetah bag and these are great size for makeup or I'm putting gifts in them, but they're good for makeup, projects, whatever. This fabric here all came from the Dollar Tree and it worked really well. I love this sloths, but it all came from the Dollar Tree. And then for when I gift the two of these, I grab these bags to put the gifts in the bags inside so I thought that was fun these two friends will love it because they love sugar skulls and Halloween so there I just busted out these it took me about three days like one night I cut it all out one day I spent a couple hours and put all the zippers in and then this morning I attached them all together and just stitched them shut and ironed them so this is done now I get the fun of filling them I want to show you what I'm working on today in my messy office. I do have coffee. Please don't worry. And more gifts. But <laughs> under here, that is all the gifts I've purchased so far that need to be. Oh, I have another bag. I forgot I made this one. I made that one for me. Because it's like sugar skull cats. <laughs> this one is for me for us, you know. Could be for makeup, small projects, like I said. I just like making bags. Um, yeah, so I made all of these the last couple days. So I get to clean up this part of my craft room and take some stuff from below and put it where it belongs. All right, next up, I think we're going to get firewood. We'll see. I have firewood. I think this is pretty hard wood too, which is gonna be nice for burning. Um, here where I'm at, this is $25 worth. And I think it will last me, hopefully, through the winter. If not, I can always go get more. It's going to go as soon as I clear the spot right here in my garage. But I have to move my ladder. But that's the spot. Let's see if we can get it over there. Oh, I'll do fun cinematics. And there we have it. We have firewood. Yeah, that should last me. Not the Duraflame logs. There's only six in there. That should last me a good long while if I don't go hog wild. So now I'm going to go inside and put a fire on. Let's do it. Hi guys, it is Sunday night and I just realized I have been so busy this weekend. Hi Dobbers. That I didn't even close out the vlog. I didn't get much on film, but I sure did get a lot done. I did show you my sewing projects. That was a huge plus for me this weekend. I got my firewood, which I've been wanting for winter. I got a haircut. Now I'm gonna sit here and cuddle with my boys and edit some videos. And I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you enjoy the content I'm putting out this holiday season. Have a good one. Night.